Back at the American model home, none of the invitees had shown up for Maybe's party. Surprise! Yeah, that's what I figured. So did you send one of these to everyone in my address book? Yeah, I'm really sorry they didn't come. I don't know what happened. I do. They found out I was 16. And a lot of us just didn't want to drive down to Orange County. What are you talking about? This cost me my job, George Michael. I was a studio executive. I made movies. Well, is that why you've been so stressed out all the time? Have I been? You know what? I'm a kid. I'm going to start acting like one. What, you're going to drink? Do you want to join me? Well, I guess if, if you can run a studio. But they didn't know it was the fake wine from Job's magic show. It's good. Look at Uncle Buster. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry no one from the family came. You know, sometimes I wish I wasn't even part of the family. Well, don't know. That, yes. No, I've never wanted to say this, but you might not even be related to us. No. Because Gangi once said to me, your mom might not have ever even been pregnant with you. OK, now you're just saying that to make me feel better. No, no I'm, uh, uh, I wouldn't. Everyone still loves you, some more than others. And perhaps it was the fake wine, but that was the night George Michael and Maybe went to second base. Tobias gives his daughter the gift he'd stayed up all night making. And here's a picture of your mother pregnant. And here's a whole series of your head starting to crown. Look at you, so full of wonder and shock. You still do it. And so does he! <laughs> Boy, you guys really are related. And Michael and Joe make an interesting I'm discovery. I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. The real Saddam has a scar on his head. I'm no scar. I'm no scar. Dot com. Dot com.